it's so good to be back at school. I enjoyed the winter break with father, but I still don't like father's new girlfriend. And I can't wait to see Claude. Me too. I can't wait to see my Jimmy. He should be back today. Didn't you visit Claude over the holidays? I did, but since we did that boyfriend tag video, he's been acting kind of weird over the phone. He'll be alright. Well, I gotta go and see if Jimmy's back. Hey, Drake and Laura. We've been waiting for you both. Oh, darling, I missed you so much. You're still not upset with me, are you? I missed you too. Don't worry about that. Great, darling. We'll see you both later. See you guys later. Oh, Jimmy, I missed you so much. I missed you too. I'll walk you to your dorm room. Hey, let's hang out later in the lounge. I think they're playing a movie there tonight. Sounds great, Jimmy. Hey, darlings. How was your winter break? It's okay, Draculaura, but we have something else we all need to discuss. Yeah, Sugar, we definitely do. Can we come in? Yes, of course. Come in and sit down. We tried to find Draculilly, but she wasn't in her room. She's probably with Jimmy. So, what's up? What's up? Sugar, we have to talk about Christmas Eve. Yeah, we have to get that ghoul back. She ruined our party. Yes, I know. Even if I don't remember most of it. Well, I remember everything. I was on the toilet all night. Yeah, me too. She ruined my romantic Christmas with dues. I was also on the toilet all night and the next day. I don't know, darling. I think we should just forget about it and call it even. What? Are you crazy? We have to get her back. When is it going to end? If we get her back, she gets us back. It's just a never-ending battle. What happened to you? This doesn't seem like you at all. I don't know. I think we just leave it alone. For now, anyways. She really got us good, and to be honest, I'm a little bit scared. She has no limits. I don't know if I can do that, sugar. I mean, I'm a forgiving person and all, but that girl needs to be taught a lesson. I don't know. Count me out, darlings. I just want to concentrate on my schoolwork and Claude right now. Well, that's boring, but I guess you're right. But don't get me wrong, darlings. I still hate that ghoul, but I think we should just let it rest for now. You know, until we're strong and ready to attack with a very good plan. There's my Draculaura. That's right, darling. But we have to keep it on the down low. I did promise Draculilli and Claude that I would let it go, but we're not finished with that ghoul. But for now, let's play it cool. Oh, Shug, you're good. You're real good. Great. Well, I better go. Want to get ready for the movie. Are you all going too? Yep, I'll be there with Claude. Not me, Sugar. I just want to chillax and maybe do some reading. Yeah, I'm just going to do my unpacking. Maybe see if Henry's back. See y'all later. Hey, you're out back. That is great. Hey, Rochelle, how was your Christmas? Well, it was interesting and short. My Christmas was great. My whole family was there. It was a lot of fun. Oh, and guess what? What? That boy Danny from the party called me. We went out a couple of times. He is very nice. That's great. His friend never called me. I wonder why. Uh, Danny is meeting me here tonight. They're having a movie night tonight in the lounge. Oh, right. That's cool. Hey, you and I should go, Abby. Hey, maybe I will ask Billy if he wants to go to the movie night. Oh, I wouldn't bother, Abby. Billy and Spectre are dating now. They're what? No way. Ugh. I know she's your friend, but I really do not like her. Hey, wait a minute. I thought you two were getting along now. Spectre is an old friend of mine. Oh, Rochelle, wake up. I was just thinking. Hey, I just want to ask Venus if she wants to watch the movie with us. What about Spectra? Eh, I'm over her. Hey, ask her to bring Abby. She's really cute. Hey, Venus, we were wondering if you and Abby wanted to come to movie night in the lounge with us. What? What? No way, I can't believe it. Hey, Porter, uh, yeah, that sounds great. We'll meet you there. Looks like I'm going to the movies, too. Hey, Tammy, what you doing? Not much, just hanging out at home. What are you both doing? We're going to watch a movie in the lounge. They're having a movie night. It's so cool. Hey, so when are you coming back to school? Oh, that does sound cool. I'll be back before you know it. Don't worry. So have any of the ghouls said anything about Christmas Eve? Nope, not yet. It's been pretty quiet here. School is closed for a few weeks. 
Oh, right. Well, I'll see you soon. Have fun and be on guard. I'm sure the ghouls are going to try to get us back. We have to be two steps ahead of them. Yep, okay. We'll keep our eyes and ears open. Great. Tammy, are you on the phone again? Come here and help me right now. Ugh, yeah, yeah, I'm coming. Ugh, can't wait to get back to school. See you later, Malian. Bye, Tammy. What does Tammy want now? Tammy wants us to be alert just in case the other girls are planning to get us back. But we really didn't do anything. We were her co-conspirators. They'll probably try to get us back, too. I hope not. Anyways, let's go to the lounge for movie night. Cleo! Cleo! Hey, Jackie Laura, what's up? Remember, we have to play nice with Marlene, Percy, and Tammy. Make them think we want a truce. Gotcha, but it won't be easy. Oh look, Jimmy, Rochelle has a date. Oh yeah, don't know him. Thanks for coming over tonight, Jesse. This is fun, I really like you, Claudine. I feel like I really know you and want you to be my girlfriend. I would love to be your girlfriend. Ah, Claudine, this is so scary. I'm gonna have nightmares tonight. Oh great, now he's got his arms around her. Shh, shh yourself. This movie sucks. Spoiler alert, the zombies did it. I'm out of here. Caparetta! Ah! This is too scary, Claudine. I can't watch anymore. Okay, then go to your dorm room. I'm not walking in the halls alone. What if there are zombies? Come with me. Oh, come on, Hillary. There's no such thing as zombies. Oh, uh, yeah, there is. What about Gulia who used to come here? She was a zombie. Yeah, but they don't attack us monsters. That's okay. We can walk into your dorm room. I've seen this movie already. You don't mind, Jesse? Of course not. Thanks, Jesse. You're the best. Hey, Marlene, are you enjoying the movie? Um, yeah, it's a bit scary, but I like it. Great, uh, good to see you guys back. We should do lunch. Uh, yeah, right. That was weird. Yeah, that was weird. So, I noticed you and Danny had a good time last night at the movies. Yes, it was nice. Danny is nice. It was a nice night. Was it really? Well, yes, I guess it was. But... Oh, forget it. You do not want to hear about it. Rochelle, I am your friend. You can tell me anything. Okay, but you're not going to like it. What? Tell me, Rochelle. You can trust me. Okay, Danny is really nice and sweet, but he's no deuce. Oh, Rochelle, I thought you were overdue and moving on. I thought that was too, but then I saw him last night in the lounge and the feelings just keep coming back. Oh, Rochelle, what are you going to do? I do not know, Abby. I really do not know. Hey, ghouls. Guess what, Abby? What? I just saw Porter and he wants to know if we want to hang out today. You, me, Porter, and Henry. I think Henry really likes you. Really? Wow, that is cool. I like Henry too. Sure, sounds good. Great, I'll text him and tell him we're on for later. What, Abby? It looks like you have a boyfriend now. Um, well, it is too soon to call him my boyfriend, but he is cool, so we'll see where it goes, and I think you should give Danny another chance. I can't believe Henry likes Abby. Abby, that white-haired snowman. What? Why do you think Henry likes Abby? They were on a date last night in the lounge for movie night. Oh, really? Sorry about that, Operetta. But I didn't think he was right for you anyways. What are you talking about? We had lots in common. Oh, yeah? Like what? Um, we're, uh... No, that's not it. Um, uh, okay, I got it. We both have red hair. Forget about Henry. How about I ask Billy if he has a friend? We can all go out on a double date. Um, okay, that sounds good. Let's do it. Great. How are things between you and Billy? They're great. Billy's so awesome. He's funny, smart. I could really fall in love with him. That's cool, honey. Hey, ghouls. We're back. Hey, how are your holidays? It was great. Yep, Lagoon and I had so much fun on our holidays. That's great. So glad you're back. How was the Christmas Eve party? Uh, don't ask. Hey, Frankie. I was just coming to see you. Hey, Jackie Laura. What's up? Just want to know how you're feeling since Jackson left. I miss seeing him every day, but we do talk on the phone a lot. Plus, he says he's coming to visit in a couple of weeks. Oh, I have a text here from Operetta. They're having another meeting about the school dance. What is the big dance? I want to make sure Jackson will be able to come. Oh, darling, the school dance is only for Scott Academy students. What? No way! 
I'm sorry, darling, but we all agree that dance is only for Skull Academy students. Yeah, but Jackson used to be a student. Come on, please, you gotta do something. I'll try. I will discuss it with them when I see them. Thanks, Jackie Laura. Please do whatever you can. Jackson and I have been talking about the dance forever. Okay, darling, I will. I better go. Okay, I'm ready to go. Great, I really want to buy a pretty dress for the dance. You did buy the tickets, right? Yep, got both our tickets. Hey, what was Jackie Laura talking to you about last night at the movies? Oh, nothing much. She was just asking about her holidays. Really? That's weird. She was being nice. Yeah, I know. I guess they don't think we were involved in the prank on Christmas Eve. Just be careful, sister. We can't trust them. Well, I think Jackie Laura is really nice. Meowlene, you can't trust any of them. And don't tell Tammy about it. She's back today from her suspension. Oh, okay, I won't. Oh, hey, Jackie Laura. I'm back. How was your Christmas? Oh, hello, Tammy. I think you know how my Christmas went. <laughs> yes, I do know. That'll teach you to mess with me. You know what? You're right. We got you back. You got us back. I think it's time we lay this to rest and call a truce. What? Are you kidding me? Nope, I'm not. I do have to hand it to you. You really got us back, and you got us back good. Respect. Well, you don't call me the evil cat for nothing. <laughs> yeah, right. See you later. We'll see who gets the last laugh. Hey, ghouls. Where is Spectra? She'll be here soon. I just saw Tammy. She's back. Looks like her suspension is over. Oh, really? Did you punch her out? Nope. I actually complimented her genius prank that she played on us. You did what? We have to make them think that we are not going to get them back. The best way to get her back is to surprise her. Oh yeah, what are we going to do to get her back anyways? I have no idea, but it gives us some time to think about it. Plus, I have to make Claude think I'm over it. Hey ghouls, are we all ready to start the meeting? Yes, we are. There is something I would like to bring up. What is it, Draculaura? Well, I know we said that dance is only for Skull Academy students, but Frankie wants Jackson to come to the dance as well. Oh, I don't know about that. If we break the rules for one ghoul, then the others will want to break it too. Yeah, but it's Frankie. I don't know. We'll have to think about it. Yeah, we all agreed that the dance is only for Skull Academy students. Y yes, but we can make an exception, can't we? I don't know. We'll see. Hey ghouls, I'm back. Miss me? Hey Tammy, good to have you back. It was getting boring around here without you. So what's up? What's been going on? Not much. We were just going to go out shopping, buy our dresses for the big dance. Oh cool, I want to come too. Oh, and we can't go to the gingerly sweet boutique. I think I've been banned. That's okay, we can go to the mall. Our father bought us a car over the holidays. You two have a car? Awesome. That's great. So, I just had a weird conversation with Jackie Laura. She wasn't even mad. She wants a truce. Really? That's great. She's actually a really nice person. What? Are you kidding me right now? We can't trust them. I bet you they're up to something. I don't know. I don't think so. Maybe they just don't want to fight with you anymore. You know, because you're so good at the prank thing, they're uh, afraid of you. Yeah, I can see that happening. You know what, ghouls? I think you're right. I think they're afraid of me and what I can do to them. So maybe we'll just leave them alone right now. Plus, I think I have a crush on one of the boys here. No way. Are you serious? Yeah, during the holidays, I saw Jeremy at the mall. We hung out for a bit. You did? Uh, yeah, well, not really. I followed him and kind of stalked him at the mall, but he has amazing taste. He was shopping at the best shops, so I think he's the right boy for me. So I think I'll focus on a date for the school dance. Wow, Jeremy, I think he's the cutest boy in school. He's so handsome, has beautiful chiseled features, beautiful bone structure. Hey, back off. He's going to be mine. Oh, right. <laughs> okay, well, don't worry about me. I'm not worried about you. When I show Jeremy my awesome charm, he'll fall head over heels for me. Did you guys buy your tickets for the dance yet? Yep, we sure did. I'm gonna ask Venus if she wants to go with me, and Henry's gonna ask Abby. That's cool. I was thinking of asking Viperine. I really like her. Oh yeah, Viperine is really pretty. What about you, Gil? Who are you taking to the school dance? I don't know yet. Maybe I'll just go by myself. Really? By yourself? Who are you gonna dance with? I'm sure not everyone is going with someone at a dance. Maybe I'll meet someone there. Yeah, maybe. I'm gonna go find Viperine, see if she'll go with me. Good luck! Oh, 
Okay, looks like we're almost done with all the plans. Let's have a recap. Dracula and Cleo are in charge of all the decorations. Spectre and I will take care of the food. But this time, let's have someone look over the table so what happened on Christmas Eve won't happen again. Yes, definitely. After that awful Christmas Eve party, we need this dance to be great. Definitely. Hey, Jackie Laura, we should drive to the mall to pick up the decorations. It'll have to be tomorrow. My car is still in the auto shop. Tammy really did a number on it. You should make her pay for it. Nah, it's alright. The less time I need to deal with her, the better. Yeah, but we're still getting her back some way, right? Oh yeah, we are. We just have to be patient and come up with a really good plan. We should do something to her at the dance. Really embarrass her. Hmm, I like that idea. Hey, Vibreen, I was just looking for you. I wanted to ask if you wanted to go to the dance with me. Um, yeah, I'd love to, Jeremy. That sounds great. Oh, man, Jeremy likes Viperine? Looks like I have a new enemy. Wow, you're so lucky. Jeremy is one of the cutest boys in school, and he seems really nice. I'm going to ask Jess to go to the dance with me. That's so cool. I can't wait. We should all go dress shopping together. I want to buy the prettiest dress. Hey, ghouls. What's up? Hey, Jackie Laura, we were just talking about the dance. Jeremy asked Viperine, and I want to ask Jesse. Oh, hang on. I'll get the door. Hey, Jackie Laura, can I talk to you for a second? Sure, darling. What's up? Well, honey, I got some bad news. Spectre and I were talking to the headmistress, and she made it clear that the dance of her skull is academy students only. We even asked about Jackson, you know, since he used to come here and all. But she said no. She was quite rude about it. Oh, no. What am I going to tell Frankie? Well, I'm sorry about that. Well, honey, I gotta go. Make sure you tell everyone not to invite any guests. Yeah, great. Everyone's going to hate us. Nothing I can do. See you later. Who's that, Jackie Laura? That was Operetta, with some bad news. What is it? The school dances for Skull Academy students only. What? No way! Are you kidding me? That's not fair. I'm sorry, darling. It's the headmistress's decision. Oh, just great. I finally get a boyfriend and I can't show him off. That's not fair. It's not fair at all. I'm sorry. There's nothing I can do. Hey, Jackie Laura. So did you ask the ghouls about Jackson coming to dance? What did they say? Uh, bad news, darling. Headmistress says it has to be for school academy students only. Yeah, but Jackson used to be a student. Doesn't that matter at all? Nope, it doesn't matter. Current students only. I'm so sorry, darling. Great, just great. Thanks a lot. Frankie! Frankie! Oh, just great. Who was that? That was Frankie. I just told her about the dance. She's not happy. Yeah, well, I'm not happy either. I'm going to start a petition to protest it. No way. If you do that, the headmistress will probably cancel it. That is right, Claudine. You can't ruin it for everyone else. How about if we sneak him in? No way. I'm not hearing this. If anything goes wrong at the dance, the headmistress will blame the dance committee, and I'm in the dance committee. All right, no protests, but I'm going to try to sneak Jesse in. Hey, that's fine. Just don't get caught. Jackson, it's me, Frankie. You're not going to believe what I have to tell you. Hey, Frankie, what is it? Jackie Laura says that only current school academy students can attend the dance. Aw, no way. I really wanted to come. I know, me too. I was really excited, and now I don't know if I want to go. Don't be sad, Frankie. When I come and visit, we'll go dancing. Yeah, but it's not the same. I really miss you, Jackson. I miss seeing you here every day. It's not the same here without you. I miss you too, Frankie. I really do. I like my new school, but it's so different. It's a public school, so no roommates or anything. I go home after school. Oh, that's cool. Have you made any friends? Yeah, I made a couple. Jackson! Jackson! Oh, I gotta go. I'll text you later. Okay, bye, Jackson. Hey, sugar. How's Jackson doing? Not great. He can't come to the dance. Only current school academy students can. Oh, no, really? No way. My boyfriend was gonna come. Well, that's just no fun. No fun at all. I know, right? What are we gonna do? Well, sugar, how about we just sneak the fellas in? What? Are you serious? How will we do that and not get caught? Well, it's really simple, hun. It'll be dark anyways. 
and everyone will be in the lounge. We'll just have to sneak them in before the dance starts and hide them somewhere. Then they can just blend right in. Yes, I love that idea, Annabelle. You're a genius. Well, I do have my moments. I'm gonna call Jackson right now and tell him about our plan. Hey, Jackson. Sorry, it's me again. Guess what? Hey, that's okay. What? Annabelle and I are gonna sneak you and her boyfriend into the dance. Um, are you sure we should do that? Yeah, why not? Well... Hey, Jackson, do you pop? Hey, who's that? Uh, just a friend from school who dropped by. Uh, your friend sounds like a girl. Is that a girl? You have a new girlfriend? Oh, Jackson, how could you? How could you do this to me? Frankie, no, it's not what you think. Frankie! I gotta go. Frankie, sugar, what's happening? Are you alright? Oh, Annabelle. Hey, Tammy, we were just coming to look for you. We're leaving now to go to the mall. Do you still want to come? How can you think about shopping at a time like this? A uh, time like what? The love of my life just asked another ghoul to go to the dance. Are you talking about Jeremy? Who did he ask? He asked Viperine. I witnessed the whole thing. Oh, Viperine. Yeah, she's really pretty. Um, I'm prettier. Say it. Say it right now. Yeah, okay, you're, you're prettier. So do you want to come with us or not? No, just go. Get out of here, the both of you. I want to be alone. I need to come up with a plan to make sure those two don't get together. Wow, Tammy needs to chill out. That's our Tammy. Come on, let's go. I'm driving. Hey, Claire, it's Tammy. Hey, Tammy, what you doing, cat girl? Enough of the small talk. I need to see you. Meet me tomorrow at the Silver Mug. You know, the new coffee shop on the corner. Sure, Tammy. What's it about? Is everything okay? No, nothing is okay. And you're going to help me make it okay. But what about Maline and Percy? Those two are getting soft, especially Maline. I can feel it. My time away from the school didn't help matters. So are you in? Um, in for what? Nothing illegal, I hope. Of course not. Well, maybe not. I don't know yet. Doesn't matter. You can always count on me. Don't worry. I haven't forgotten about you and Claude. You help me with my problem called Viperine, and I'll help you with your problem called Jackie Laura. Tammy, that sounds good to me. I'll see you tomorrow. Great. Bye. If things go well, it will be I who will be dancing with Jeremy at the dance. <laughs> Oops, sorry, Jackie Lily. <laughs> Are you making out with Jimmy? Hey, were you all spying on us? Jackie Lily, I thought boys weren't allowed in the dorm rooms anymore. Yeah, so? You're not going to tell anyone, are you? No, of course not. I better go. We don't want to get caught. Okay, Jimmy. See you later. We'll go to a movie. Don't classes start tomorrow? Didn't the headmistress say we can't leave the campus on school night? Right again, Gidget. Boy, aren't you full of information today. Yeah, I got bored of the holidays and missed school so much that I read the school rule book. Great. That's so cool, Gidget. Can you tell me what the rules are? I sure can. Okay, I'm out of here. Wait, I'm coming too. Let's go hang out in the lounge. I don't think I want to be here for this. Sorry, ghouls. Okay, but you're going to miss out on all the fun. Is the coast clear? Looks like it. Okay, let's go. Hey, Nikki Lily. Hey, Jimmy. Shh, you didn't see us, okay? Yeah, okay. Hey, Gidget. Hey, Hillary. I'm back. Hi, Kitty. How were your holidays? It was great, but I'm glad to be back. Hey, Michelle. Where are you off to? Oh, hi, Abby. Danny called. I'm meeting with him at the Silver Mug Coffee Shop. That is so great. You decided to give Danny another chance. Well, I did not know. I was going to be honest with him and tell him about Deuce. What? No way, Rochelle. Come on, give Danny another chance. He really likes you. I can tell. Deuce will never leave Cleo. You have to move on, Rochelle. Oh, stop it, Debbie. You're never there to support me. You're always so negative. Don't you believe in true love? Uh, well, I do. I believe in true love. It was my mistake breaking up with Deuce, and I will have to live with that. But I will not stop trying. I know he still cares about me. Oh, Rochelle. No, I do not want to hear anymore. If you can't be my friend and support me, then I don't want to talk to you about it anymore. I have to go. I'm going to be late. Oh, Rochelle. 
Well, I think we have enough posters to hang around the school. It's going to be the best dance ever. I know, right? I can't wait. I'm so happy that I have a boyfriend to take me. Billy already bought our tickets. Isn't he sweet? Yeah, so sweet. So sweet that it makes me want to vomit. You don't have to rub it in, Spectra. Oh, I'm so sorry, Operetta. I didn't mean... Yeah, yeah, whatever. Did you ask Billy about finding me a fella? Um, yes, I did. As soon as he... Oh, it's Billy. And he says that he has a friend that you might like. No way, no way. So when can I meet him? Text him. Hey, Billy, when can Operetta meet him? What do you say? Has he replied yet? No, hang on. Give him a minute. What's it say? He says you can meet him tomorrow. Billy invited him here to meet you. Oh my gosh, I think I'm going to faint. But we have classes tomorrow. He's coming here around dinner time. Okay, great, perfect. Oh my gosh, Spectra, I'm nervous. I'm nervous already. What am I going to wear? I can't go to class tomorrow. I need a face mask. I must really do something with my hair. Operetta, relax. You have to calm down. This is how you scare boys away. You get too excited and then you stop acting like yourself. You know you're right, honey. But how can I change right tomorrow? I really like Porter. He seems really sweet. He asked me the dance date. Isn't that exciting? Yes, very exciting. You two look good together. Did Henry ask you to the dance? Nope, he has not. Oh, that's weird. Porter told me he was going to ask you. Oh, really? Well, he hasn't. Hey, maybe that's him. Go answer it. All right, I will. But it's probably not him. Oh, hi, Henry. How are you? Hey, Abby, I'm good. I wanted to ask you the dance. Oh, well, yes, I would love to go to the dance with you. Great, that's great. Well, we will have a good time. Okay, that sounds very nice, Henry. Great, good night. Wow, he really likes you, Abby. Ooh, Abby has a boyfriend. Okay, Venus, that is enough. Rochelle, how was your date with Danny? Ooh, another date with Danny? I must be getting serious. So what happened, Rochelle? I decided to give Danny another chance. He is really sweet, and he bought me a ticket to the school dance. What? How did he get the ticket? Jackie and Laura sent me a text about the dance, and we cannot invite guests because it's for school academy students only. I don't know, that's what he said. Hmm, well, that's weird. Oh well, maybe he was talking about another dance. Maybe it's his school. Yes, maybe you're right. Oh, hi, Andy. What is it now? Oh, come on, Cherry. Give me another chance. I don't know. I kind of started seeing someone else. I know I made a mistake. you got to give me another chance. Yeah, yeah, okay, whatever. Oh, my friend just got here. Gotta go. See you tomorrow. Oh, look at me. I'm flying. Oh, how cool is this? Wow, that was a cool dream. Oh no, I'm late. I'm late for class. I can't believe I slept in. Where is my hairbrush? Oh, this is not going to be a good day. I better go. I'll brush it later. Hey, Dracula, early class today? Yes, I am late. I'm so late. Oh, I gotta go. Bye. No, uh, you're not late. The clock's broken. Haha, <laughs> Jackie Laura looks awful today. Gosh darn it, I am so late. I hate being late. I have a perfect record. Hey, where is everyone? Hey, Gidget, where is everybody? Am I still dreaming? Huh? No, class hasn't started yet. It's only 8 o'clock. Oh no, are you serious? Great, my clock must be broken. Uh, Jackie Laura, did you get dressed in the dark? Hey Jackson, is your girlfriend still there? Don't be silly, Frankie. You are my girlfriend. That was just a friend from school. We have to do a project together. A couple of my other friends are here, too. Really? Yes, really. You're the only girl for me, Frankie. Oh, Jackson, I just miss you so much. But anyways, I better go. I'm just going into class. Talk to you later. Wow, you really know a lot about the rules of Skull Academy. Yep, there's lots of
lots more to know. I can tell you. Um, no, that's okay. I can go up to your dorm room later and tell you. It'll be fun. No, uh, you're very sweet, darling, but I, uh, I, I have to wash my hair. Yeah, yeah, I have to wash my hair. Oh, look, there's Frankie. Hey, Frankie. Hi, Jackie Laura. Are you still talking to me? Of course I am. Why wouldn't I? Well, that's kind of mean. I'm really sorry. I was just upset. That's okay, darling. I understand. Annabelle had a great idea. We're going to sneak Jackson and Annabelle's boyfriend to the dance. Frankie, the less I know, the better. Oh, okay. And what happened to your hair, by the way? And your clothes. I think your top's inside out. And I know your skirt is. Yeah, I need a new clock. Hi, Billy. Thanks for telling me about your friend. I can't wait to meet him later. Oh, no problem. He's one of my friend's brothers, so I really don't know him that well, but I hope you like him. Well, I hope I like him, too. Hey, Operetta. Whoa, Sugar, what happened to you? I had a rough morning. Well, Sugar, you need to run a brush to that hair. Anyways, guess what? I have a date tonight. Wow, you have a date? Tell me more, darling. It's Billy's friend. I'm meeting him at the Silver Mug Coffee Shop later. Ooh, that sounds interesting. I can't wait to hear all about it later. Juice, everything is going great with us now, isn't it? Yep, so far so good. Oh, and I got your ticket for the dance. Aw, thanks, honey. I can't wait. I'm going to make sure my dress is the prettiest, Juice. And you have to dress up too, okay? Yeah, yeah, if I have to. You will look so handsome. All the other ghouls will be so jealous. Oh, yuck. Great. Now I feel sick. Ignore her, Cleo. Okay, you two. Get into class. Yep, right away, Mrs. Nile. Okay, let's start with the attendants. Annabelle? Peasant. Billy? Yo. Cleo? Here. Deuce? Here. Jackie Laura? Here. Jackie Lily? Jackie Lily? Anyone know where she is? Um, I wonder where Jackie Lily is. Jimmy's not here either. Maybe they ran off together and got married. Frankie? Here. Gidget? Here. Jimmy? Mm, not here. Mialine? Here. Operetta, here. Tammy, here. Okay, everyone, open up your textbooks to page 60 and let's get started. Where could Dracula Lily be? I'm getting worried now. I'm sure she's fine. I hope you're right. After I change and fix my hair, I'm going to go looking for her. Oh no, Jimmy, what are we going to do? I wanted to surprise Jackie Lord today and pick up our car from the auto repair shop and now look at it. She'll understand. And now we missed our class this morning. We're so late and we'll get in so much trouble. I'm not worried about that. We should just take the rest of the day off and play hooky. No, we can't do that. Jackie and Laura will kill me if I miss school. And what will we tell the headmistress? It's not so easy to skip school for living there. Yeah, I guess you're right. You're such a good influence on me, Jackie Lily. It's not easy keeping you on the straight and narrow. Okay, well, we're not far from school. Let's walk over there. And I have a friend who can pick up your car and fix it. But it'll cost you money. Oh no, where am I going to get money? My father won't pay for it. 